All right, we are back playing Monster Madness. This is part two. I did part one back in October, and I had no idea that people were going to be interested in that as much as they were. Thank you so much to everybody who watched part one or liked the video. Um, left some comments on there. I appreciate that. I didn't realize how much nostalgia and how much of a cult following this game had. Um, so we're going we're gonna to play some more of it because see if we can get further in it. Uh, we're on level 7. I did bring down the difficulty because this game is so hard to play on your own. I just want to try and get through it as much as we can. So, uh, hope you're all doing well. And welcome to part 2, months later. <laughs> Alright, so we're at level 7, the shopping mall. Shopping day. I believe this is the level we're on. Because we just did that parking lot level. That was a nightmare. So, in case you guys are wondering, I'm playing on a real Xbox 360 with the actual game. I don't do any kind of emulating or anything like that on my channel. We have it. Great. Some leprechaun. <laughs> what is that? This game makes me laugh. We gotta get five uh, golden zombies. Yeah, Carrie's like, I don't want to be doing this. Okay, I kind of remember this area from when I used to play this game. Zombies eat human brains to survive, so it figures that if a human eats a zombie brain, he'll become a zombie. I added some of Larry's special spices to keep you in control while transport. Okay. So you can use the right trigger to perform a melee. Uh, let's Why see. There's the zombie dance. There's a mortar. Okay. Gosh, this game is so jank. Somebody was asking about the camera, I think, in part one. So I didn't, couldn't remember what it was. So if you hit Y, it zooms you out. If you hit Y again, it zooms closer in. For this, I think I actually want to zoom out a little bit. So I can kind of see more of the level. How do I get the, the golden zombies? What does it want me to do? I wasn't paying attention to what it wanted. It's telling me to go here for some reason. Lord knows why. I think I gotta dance near him first. Get them to follow me into here. Teehee! Yeah, whatever, buddy. Alright. I mean, seriously, I can't believe that how many views this part one accumulated, so. So we're coming back to this, so. If any of you subscribed because of part one, well, here you go. Here's more of this game that you love. Um, I do actually like this game. I think it's I think it's a lot of fun. But as I said many times in part one, it's best enjoyed uh, with with friends. Co-op in this is, is quite a blast. Shoot. 
Come on. Oh no, spiders. Oh my gosh. Come on. There we go. He only needs five, right? Like I said, I did turn down the difficulty because it was very hard for me to play by myself. Part one. We had a lot of parts where I couldn't get by it real quick. So I just, I kind of want to just be able to get through it. So we'll get as far as we can. See all the levels. I mean, this game's got a lot of good things about it. And I don't know how it's... It's probably still relatively cheap to get, but uh, I feel like it could be one of those games that eventually goes up in price. But I had gotten this game used for like, uh, like ten bucks or something out of like GameStop or whatever back in the day, like goat zombies. We need to find two more gold ones. Shoot. Have some parts there. Oh my gosh. This guy's gonna kill me. Fight for me. guys. The goat riding zombies have got to go. Hmm. Problem here, we'll be finding these other, uh... There's another one. Great thing about this game too, guys, is that it is published by the wonderful publishers that did Two Worlds. Of course, uh, South Peak Games. Come on, come on. Is they, are they still following me? Okay, here we go. Wait, do we need to get all those zombies that are at the bottom of the screen there? Because he only said five. Did he lie to me? Oh good, this one's following me too. Come on. Let's go, everybody. Everybody in here. So I need to get more than five zombies. I need to get... I still need to get five more. Well, this is going to be a problem. Especially if I can't find um, a health place. I need to find somewhere where there's health. It's like an outdoor shopping mall. The level designs in this game are great. Oh, freaking clown. Got him. Okay. Get up there, Carrie. Zombie Carrie. Maybe I gotta go up the up escalator. Okay, so apparently I can't get up to the second floor. At least not from there. There's another guy. Come on. Let's go, friend. Get everybody joining the party here. Come on. <laughs> what is that noise? Here's another one. Alright, they're all in love. They're all in love with Carrie. Let's go. Oh, dang. Here's a whole bunch more. Don't attack, don't attack, come on. The more zombies I get from my team, the better, I think. I think they do fight the evil ones. Come on, let's go. I gotta get the gold ones back. There's another one here, too. 
This one keeps respawning. Get them all in here. Well, that's not even the right one I needed. Come on. So the ones I've already gotten respawn. That's not going to help me find which ones I need. Come on. Here we go. Come on in, in, in. Come on in. Yeah, so we need two more, the ones we haven't found yet. I guess we should just keep dancing near these other zombies to help to help us fight. I don't like that the ones we've already gotten respawn, so how am I supposed to know which ones I still need to get then? We need a police officer and a guy with like a trucker hat, so I guess we'll just go based on what their picture looks like. There's a guy with a trucker hat. There's Jolt as well. He's right. Oh, not these freaking things. Shoot. <laughs> Come on. Oh my gosh. Right, can I get some Jolt, please? It won't let me get Jolt. Oh, maybe I don't know if I can actually die as a zombie. Right, let's go. At least still there's a gold spider. What happened to my my zombies I had? I lost one. See, it's so tough to get them back. We just need two more. There's another police officer. I think we need him. Hey, what's up, Ronick? How you doing tonight, man? Alright, here are these two. Let's go. So we're gonna go get away from the clowns. Shoot, dynamite, go this way. Get rid of him. Come on, come on. Come on. Almost there. I hope these are the last two I need. Oh, there's one of them. We just need a guy with a trucker hat now. <laughs> Move this back. Have a little sip of the tea real quick. Tea helping me heal and stay relaxed and everything. place to farm like gems and stuff though. Alright, I think this is the guy we need. He looks like it is, right? He's got the hat on. Let's see if we can get him over there. There's another one. There's like oh well, here's another guy over there. Alright, come on, everybody follow me. Let's go. You, and you especially, come on.
Got a ways to go. Darn it. Come on, they killed my zombie. Alright, this might be the guy we need, though. No, did they kill him? Come on, come on, come on. He's almost dead. Come on, come on. They're pink hearts. The pink hearts, they uh, they show you the their level of uh, health there. What game is that? It's uh, Monster Madness Battle for Suburbia. It's Xbox 360 title. I think it was on the PS3 as well. It's a four it's a four player co-op game, couch co-op. Uh, which is something that you don't see a lot of anymore these days. We have the key. We are back to being carry. Oh, hurry up and die. Extinguish the fire. Alright. Crap, now I'm gonna get killed. Get the spiders. It's pretty much a game where you fight monsters and zombies and stuff. I always compare it to like Zombies ate my neighbors. It's very janked. Oh yeah. That's what makes it so good though. <laughs> I love the jank games. You'll see me playing a lot of jank games like this on the channel. It's kind of one of the things I like to do. Licensed games. I love licensed games. Bad licensed games. And, you know, but we'll give anything a try here. We don't discriminate against any game. <laughs> Even the bad ones. I have a lot of jank bad games in my collection. A lot of which I haven't even like tried yet. I, I find them out in the wild. So I'll be playing plenty of other stuff. But this is one I used to play when I was younger. With my friends, so it's kind of nice. Coming back to some more of this. Gotta find those... Uh, there's the vending machines. I want to get to the vending machines. Collect stuff. These parts are how you do, you know, upgrades. So you gotta collect those. We can get ammo. And health. Got plenty of gems right now. Um, how do I switch my weapon? That's what I don't remember. There we go. There we go. I mean, it's usually it's easier to do the melee attacks in this, but let's go refill our health again, real quick. You're switching to Nintendo to do more streaming for Nintendo stuff. But you're going to be playing RPG and adventure games on Xbox One. But you're going to start to focus more on Nintendo. Yeah, play Yeah, play whatever you want. Um, yeah, there's a lot of good stuff on Switch. There's a ton of good stuff on and, and all the Nintendo consoles, really. So, can't go wrong with that. Um, I do play a lot of Xbox One games myself. But I'm pretty much open to streaming. <laughs> anything. There we go, you're going here. <laughs> Holy crap, what was that? <clears throat> you're gonna be streaming on Xbox One because you don't have a capture card yet. Yeah, that's exactly what I did like when I first started streaming. What the heck? Oh, my controller came unplugged. You know, I, for a while when I first started my channels, I was only able to stream directly through Xbox One, like you. And it was working out. I was having fun. I found a lot of good games to play. And But I always wanted to do more. I always wanted to be able to, to stream games I grew up playing and pretty much stream almost anything I own and could, could end up getting. Just opened up my when I got my capture card, opened up my library. It's one of the best things I did for my channel was to was to get a capture card so I could really open up 
you know, my, my options of what I could do. Okay, they keep freezing me. It's like a boss here. Some levels in this game are very enjoyable, and other ones are just so freaking hard. Who keeps telling me to smile for the camera? I will not smile for the camera. Alright, more ammo. Let's reload. That's all. Locked there. Who is telling me to do that? Is it this guy? There's two. Darn it. They freeze you. Gotcha. This game is such a real old school feel. It's just, it's, it's a lot of fun. I did part one back in October, and where did I get the Triforce light? Um, I think I got it at GameStop actually, a long time, like years ago. Probably like four or five years ago, I think I got it at a GameStop. It was like 20, 30 bucks, something. It wasn't like super expensive, but I love it. I always want to get like more lights like that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is hard to do by yourself. Lots of spiders coming down. So they're gonna keep coming after me, but I can keep buying ammo, I can keep buying jolt. Lollipop Chainsaw Dead Island on Xbox. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I, I played Lollipop Chainsaw in October for the first time. I streamed it, and uh, I loved it. That game was so much fun. It was freaking awesome. Dead Island, I used to play that game, too. I don't own it anymore, though, sadly. I want to get that game again. Anything with zombies, I'm like, count me in. <laughs> Any game that has zombies in Zombie games, Disney games, soccer games are kind of my horror games. Some of my favorites. Alright, so I gotta go this way. Checkpoint, good. Oh, look at this pumpkin over here. This is very Halloween. Happy Halloween, it says. Xbox One. Game Pass, that's cool. Rocket League, I love Rocket League. I've streamed a lot of Rocket League before. I haven't streamed it in a long time, but at least for like to put on YouTube. Um, yeah, I freaking love Rocket League. I actually almost thought about streaming that game tonight. I thought maybe um my girlfriend wanted to play something we could play that I would stream it she could be on my team Rocket League yeah I guess that counts as a soccer game right <laughs> Jacko yeah I might play Rocket League tomorrow we'll see we'll see how, how it goes I do play some online matches. You're welcome to join our club. We I have a club that I started in Rocket League on Xbox One and pretty much any plat because it's cross-platform. So um, then you can have your you, you can be in a stream technically. You know, I'll show your your name will be on the team and we'll be playing. I just won't be able to use a headset or anything because I'm going to be talking through my mic. But at least we can play. See, if I'm ever streaming Rocket League online, 
and you're watching, uh, feel free to uh, to join the matches, Aronic. Um, if we have, you know, the team playing, because I have a club called Zero United that we I have. My friend Beantown Hero on there. My girlfriend's on there. Our friend Aileen. So the guy named George is on there. What is this guy? Oh, that guy was like sleeping. Can't get him. Darn it. Alright, 29 of 32 kill count. Okay. Yeah, it's like I said, I'm not sure when I'll stream that next, but um, when I do. I'm trying to play through some other games right now, but um, but don't don't you worry. Rocket League will will be a part of the channel going forward as always. I, I freaking love that game. It's quite addicting, Rocket League. What is this? <laughs> All right, Jacko. Mr. Huddles. Oh my gosh. Jack o' Lantern's coming at me. I'm trying, I'm trying. Can I get. Stop them before they eat me! Oh, okay, I can just use this freaking thing. How do I fire? Oh, I have to hold it in. I'm like tapping the trigger. This thing's so sensitive. Look how jank this is. See, if you had four players, you'd have four different turrets here going off, and they wouldn't stand a chance. I'm trying to do this by myself. I have to fend him for another two minutes as well. And he's already got a bar of health gone. And these turrets lose lose health as well. Actually, I should probably jump into another another turret. Come on, get in there. Come on, come on, come on. I should be able to do it. Back and forth. Pumpkins. Yeah, they're like pumpkins, they all, they all blow up, though. They're all explosive. Man, what the frig? Don't let him take me! <laughs> Hilarious. 54 seconds, come on. He's got plenty of health, we'll do it. Oh shoot, kamikaze ones, lots of them. <laughs> Dang, this is crazy. Oh no, the guys in the wheelbarrows are the worst. We got this. We got it. I mean, this section's going on probably longer than it needs to, but whatever. And seriously, with four people running these turrets, how would you ever... How would they ever get to that? Jeez, that was loud, too. That might be the end of the level. The levels are long too, and there's like 20 or so of them. I mean, this is a 
It's not a short game to play this one. Now we got health. We got plenty of ammo still. There's Mr. Huggles. Very intense. <laughs> oh gosh. What the frag? Do we have to like... Is this a boss fight? I want to say it is. We were just protecting him, weren't we? I got toys. We could pick up the toys and throw it at him. Okay. Lower him to an electrical. Uh. I got him once, but I also got caught in that. So you gotta lower him into this. I don't know. I think I gotta do it two more times. Now we gotta play the notes on the keyboard. Okay. Look what we're doing right now. Boom. Playing playing a D. That's a D. That's a D note. Okay. Be an F sharp. Boom. I just want a hug. All right, let's go over here. Play another D note. Why am I trying to lower him here? Okay, I see what we're trying to do here. Oh well, yeah, I don't think anybody's gonna be hugging this freaking thing. I mean, imagine this. No. Why do you want to hurt me? I must have beat this boss with friends because I don't remember ever trying this by myself. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Darn it. Come on. Isn't the voice actor like doing this freaking part in the studio? Came in for like a day. I want you to get paid to do this thing's voice. <laughs> How do I get him over here? There we go. I pour the water. Yeah. Now we gotta lure him into the generator. Y men, instead of X men, we got Y men. What happened to me? Why am I dizzy? Well, that was that was great. <laughs> and then he just blows. Oh my gosh! That's a job of the huggle. 
Now we gotta really fight this thing. Have an airplane. Oh dang, I just threw the airplane at him and it worked. Here's a controller, here's an Xbox 360 controller. There's a way to dodge, there we go. Is there health in here? Cause I'm out of health. All right, his health is that doll down there with the picture next to it. I'm getting up here, like, I, I can't get away from him. I'm just gonna have to like spam my gun. It's freaking dead. Keep running, keep running. Let's go around in circles. Slowly work down his health. Once he starts spinning, that's when we gotta start moving. Oh, move, move, move. <laughs> I don't like to dodge like that. You have to click in the left stick, so it's kind of kind of hard to pull off. Something. What the hell was that? A yo-yo? Almost got him. Gonna like, so I just start throwing random toys at him. <laughs> he looks like a mid cooked potato. Oh, that's that was that's so perfect, Ronick. <laughs> He's like a baked potato that was never finished. Happy Put a little sour cream on him. Look at all the gems he dropped. I didn't even get to collect them all. So that's the end of the level. See, that was all just one level. It took us like 35 minutes to get through one level. Continue to the next level. Level 8. Because we did like a three half hour episode for part 1 back in October. And I think I, we only did like six levels in that time. But some of them were like really hard to do. Level 8. Mall Field Tour. So we're back up. Okay. gonna be a monster fest. Oh. What's going on? No, oh, what is he doing? He's getting his army going. Captain Bones. Alright. Monster fest, I knew it. Grab these. There we go. We gotta throw the skulls at those punks. Darn it. I'm actually gonna get my, uh, my sword out here. Give me another oh, skull. Gotcha. All right, three of eleven. I remember. I remember this part of the game. I gotta fight these freaking guys. Oh my gosh, I hate these guys. Look at their movements. All right, there is health over here. I'm gonna have to get my my gun back out. I do have a shield. <laughs> All right. 
There we go. My gosh. Oh dang, yeah, go to go to sleep, man. 2 a.m. for you, yeah. Definitely get some sleep. I appreciate you stopping by again, Ronick. Always good to see you again. Take it easy, man. I'll be seeing you soon. As always, keep safe. We have a Zeppelin now. Alright, let's uh let's grab some ammo to fill that right up. Yeah, in order to have a chance in this game, we have to put on like the easiest difficulty, really. I mean, I was struggling on just normal difficulty so bad. This is a lot more playable and more fun. launcher, don't I? Yeah. Oh, it's a shotgun. There we go. Uh, it's time to get some more jolt. Got a lot of ammo for this, too. Dang. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Yeah, no problem, Ronick. Yeah, I said, come and go as you please here. Do do what you got to do. You can always come in to another one or watch back on YouTube if you want. Appreciate you coming in. Exactly, am I doing here? I don't know what's happening right now. Uh, I'm throwing bombs, though. I have a jack o' lantern on my head. I honestly don't know what I'm... I'm supposed to be filling up this pit with junk, but I don't get how it's working here. These punks are killing me. I don't have any bombs? I was going to say, can I use something else to fight? Goodness me. Take this stuff. Am I just sucking this stuff up or am I like I think I gotta move it over here. Here we go. Yeah. I don't I don't understand what's happening. <laughs> Yeah, you as well, Ronick. Thank you again. Have a good night, man. Okay, I guess we got a lot of stuff in there now. I think we just gotta fill up that red bar at the bottom. We're almost there. 
Just keep pushing junk into that. I'm gonna freaking die though. Get some health. I like that there's health machines around here. And I got plenty of money, so I don't have to worry about really dying. I I guess what I'm doing is working. I don't know. Honestly, this is so so freaking jank right now. I I did it. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. Before we go in there, let's, uh, as always, get ammo, get health in case we need it. What? All terrain vehicles. We got like these. Samurai guys coming after us now. There's, I mean, they do a good job of putting like new villains. There's a lot of enemies in this game, which is another impressive thing. They certainly designed a lot of enemies. So you're not fighting the same thing over and over and over again. There's always something new around the corner. And you can pick up a lot of stuff in the level and throw it at the enemies. They gotta make more games like this though, like they just don't make them anymore. After the 360 era, you see. I know they made like a Zombie Land game that looks really good. I wanted to get that one. That kinda looks like along the lines of this. All terrain vehicle, okay. Gee, I don't know. Well, we got we got we got air hockey though. I don't suppose you want to challenge me to air hockey. Pool tables. Where's the foosball? A little mini golf course here. Collect some stuff. I love this area here, this is great. Can we bounce? Oh, we can bounce on the trampoline, of course we can. We actually can get up there. Look at this. Oh, no. So, oh, there's a quads up there, I didn't see those. gonna be hard especially with these guys coming after me oh, it goes back down if I'm not running on it they got like a freaking tennis ball launcher here shooting at me it's so hard to stay on this thing <laughs> Come on, Carrie. I know you look like you're in pretty good shape, but we need you to, to, to move it here. A little bit faster here. Work the quads. Oh, gosh. Oh, fudge. Get up there. Oh, this is super jank. Almost got it. Almost got it. Just don't want to die. All right, we did it. I gotta go get health. Not yet. I guess some jolt in me. All right. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Shoot, how do I get out of here? Darn it. I mean, I can't even make this jump here. Where am I going? Where am I going? Monster Fest? Looks like it. That's why I played this game in October for part one, because this is a very. It's a, a bit of a Halloween feel to it for sure with all the, the monsters and stuff. The music. Billy. Oh, hey, Billy. Oh my gosh. 2 out of 35. I think I'm just gonna keep going around in a circle here. It's hard to steer and aim the turn at the same time. I'll do my best. I think if I go around a circle and just shoot what's behind me, this might be the best course of action here. I should start shooting what's ahead of me. Whoa, Bigfoot. Twenty-eight of thirty-five. We're getting there. Thirty-two. Thirty-three. There we go. Oh, I did. Into the supermarket we go. Oh my gosh. Possessed cart. So like obvious what they call things. Oh, this is gonna be something here. Go, 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 follow it, follow it. It's hard to drive with this, <laughs> this camera angle. Honestly, if we destroy all these shelves, it'll be easier to hit them. I should just stay in one spot and just aim my turret. Drop 
Back part broken yet? Come on. This is fun. There. So we have to hit the... Gosh. He's leaving bombs behind him. Ah. Oh. Okay, now I might want to stand still and just hit him when he comes by. It's a pretty neat boss fight, I guess, but it's just like trying to get him by myself. I gotta focus on uh, these things. Have to go because they're blocking a lot of my shots here. Cart. I mean, it's a long boss fight too. Now we got a guy shooting at us. Oh, he's just gonna keep pecking away at me every time. Can't see him. If I lose this thing, I'm gonna be screwed. I think. He's hitting me non-stop. Look at this. It's taking forever. Okay. Whoa. Now it's just Billy. Again. No, go, 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 go. Again, I think I'm just going to drive around. Oh, you got to focus here. Because one joystick steers the car. The other one steers the turret. So you got to kind of... It's not easy. Meanwhile, you're hitting the trigger to, to gas, to accelerate, I should say. Seems to be working, though. Oh, Billy. Come on, Billy, die. There we go. Oh, he's still not dead, huh? Come 
Come on, Billy, just give up already. down. We've done two levels tonight. Very nice. We'll do another one. Yeah, much more enjoyable on the easier difficulty. She gives me a chance. I may have not beaten that boss on normal difficulty by myself. So baby, what kind of names do you like anyway? <laughs> one with a vehicle. A big one. A big vehicle. Well, I'm skateboard. <laughs> I hate skateboards. Me too. The boy wonder. I think these are some of that. Ah, high school. This reminds me. Um, well, Carrie, what I really wanted to tell you during the sunset, where we can just start to see the beautiful moon, the stars, the Orion Belt, the giant flying saucer crashing down in flames. Oh, now we're going to fight aliens. <laughs> Level 9, track and field. Here we go. It's a very inventive game, for sure. Like, they came up with a lot of stuff for this. I just, I love the 360 era as well. There's so many gaming areas that I... I love this is another one. 360, PS3, Wii kind of era. I love that. Wii Wii U. saucers now. Aliens. This game's got it all. You got werewolves, zombies, aliens. There's, I think there's vampires in this. What more do you need? Pilot the UFO. I'm not. Oh, am I supposed to be in an L in a, an LFO in a UFO right now? Alright. Oh, this is not an easy thing either. Okay. I can feel for these controls here. Flying a freaking UFO. There's a lot of different mechanics like this in the game, like different vehicles and stuff that you get to fly. It's like keeps it keeps it fun. So my advice, guys, if you play this game by yourself, definitely play on the easiest difficulty to give yourself a chance. That's a pretty hardcore. I mean, you could probably do it in normal. I just. I don't feel like struggling on the same level for like an hour long. So where I got, I used to get pretty far in this game. I want to say I made it to like level, I don't know how far I got. Alright, are we done? I 
Yes, we are. Oh, should, should I still be in the UFO? I'm gonna get back in the UFO. <laughs> Duck them. Yes. Come on at this guy again. We gotta fly through rings. Don't tell me. Oh, what is this? Now it's turning into Superman 64. There. Oh, we really have to fly through the rings. Like, all. Oh, oh my gosh. They're like killing me. I'm just gonna try and get through the rings as quick as I can. You don't have to fly through them, you just kinda have to touch them. It's not as bad as Superman 64. Then again, what is? Superman 64 is a game I wish I could play through, but I don't think I'd have the patience to deal with how bad the controls are. Come on, where's the next one? There it is. Nine to fifteen. It's kind of hard to tell because of the camera angle. I like to see where you are, how close you are to the rings. This isn't too bad, though. Yeah, I would. I'm not even focusing on fighting. I'm just gonna get the stupid rings. There we go. Like, why is there a leprechaun? Soccer field, nice. It's hard to aim because I can't move that cursor where the aimer is. It's all camera relative. Probably supposed to get out of the UFO at this point. But I don't wanna. Monster Fest. UFO's halfway dead, we might have to get out of this. What the? It says kill count 0 of 23, but I already took out a few UFOs. going on? It's like invisible enemies or something. Out of this thing soon. Time to ditch. Nice. 
soccer field. Dimensions look pretty good for the net. <laughs> See, look at this game's great. It's a, it's a horror game and a soccer game all in one. Two of my favorite genre games. <laughs> Don't forget that he might be slow. I can see that he is. Hold on, I want to get some ammo. Oh my gosh. UFOs are going to be a big problem here. Right, let's keep going. Can we get him in here? Okay. So if I can actually continue to progress in this game, I will probably do a full playthrough of this now on the channel and get through this game, give it some closure. Starting to kind of bring back some games I was playing before but never finished. See what we can maybe get through. You guys got all that? You hear them? Billy! Freaking Billy! Right there. Leather, leather face. Come on. Crap, he's got me cornered. Ugh. Hold on. Do I get my shotgun? <laughs> I think I just took his chainsaw. Spiders. No. No more spiders. Get ready. Oh, Jesse. Huh. I'm so glad you're here. Hmm. Are you still cleaning and organizing? Get ready for this. What the frig? What is happening? We're playing dodgeball. Oh, dang. How do I catch them? Oh, this is great. Boom. I was always pretty good at dodgeball. But in my school, they called it bombardment, so it wasn't quite called dodgeball. Bombardment used, um, I don't know if anybody knows what bombardment is, but it was like dodgeball, but they used smaller things, almost like these little cloth balls that you would throw. They were kind of a little bit faster than throwing a dodgeball. I was always one of the best in my school. A bombardment. Uh. About to get busy in here. I mean, it's about to get busy in here. 
How's Koya's stream going? I mean, I was watching that. I thought, did they do another round? You're still cleaning? Okay. We just had Ronick here for a little while. He was watching. That's for making me wear gym shorts. Yeah, she's like an octopus spider, whatever. That's gross. Okay, let's grab all the gems. Another level down. Next level. Oh, what up, Koya? Raiding with 26 people. Holy shite. Aldo is here. Jujubee's back. Angelic Angry. Koya, Koya. Thank you so much for the raid. Thank you guys for coming in. Uh, I was watching a bunch of your Smash Brothers thing going there. Against Cybermuse. You guys did good. I saw the first run you guys had. How you guys beat them. Hey Jujubee, how you guys doing? How's everyone doing? Did you guys do another round? Bana, I saw you. Had some good matches on Smash Brothers for sure. You guys are watching me play a really giant game right now. So, do I not have my weapons? Oh shoot. I have to like pick things up. I need to kill 12. Guys, I don't have a weapon. What is this? I'm gonna use a chair. Okay, I'm gonna die. What the frig? You guys all seem to do really well on that. You're tired? I say, you guys must have been streaming for a while then, because I was watching for like at least an hour. I saw Aldo playing. That was, I, I really, I was coming there to watch Aldo do some matches too. <laughs> I'm not sure I would have gained any stock for you guys if I had been on the team. That's for sure. Maybe if I got lucky. Look how jank this is. I'm literally fighting with my fists because she doesn't have any weapons right now. I'll pick up this chair. <laughs> Come at me. So I hope everybody's doing good. Getting ready for bed, are ya? You can chill and lurk if you want while I struggle to, to get through this. If Angelic can do it, I can do it? Wow, they just threw you right under the bus. They just said no problem throwing you right under the bus. So I'm a demon now. You guys haven't seen me play Smash Brothers. Jesse has. She'll know that I'm not that good at it. But I, you know, it's such a good game, anyways. I've played all the Smash Brothers games ever since the original one on N64. Um, I want to go in the classroom. Oh dang! How do I turn back into the demon? Did I already waste that? <laughs> Maybe it's time. I really want some weapons, that would be nice. <laughs> My gosh, this game is jank. I beat you with Rob. <laughs> Everybody's throwing shade, alright, alright. 
But ROB is one of my best characters, though. I actually know a lot of his moveset. Detention. How many of you guys got detention in school? I don't think I ever got detention. Forever. Forever. What the heck am I fighting right now? You really never know what's going to happen in this game. Get me out of here. Go through here. Am I not, am I supposed to do like a stealth thing here? What am I? I just want to kill these arms. Okay, there we go. Gosh. Can't mend it in glass plate. You got detention every day for a year for being late to school. I believe it. <laughs> You're a rebel, I can see. No hall pass. What? That's it. Is he gonna keep kicking me? I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Alright, what does this guy want from me? He keeps saying no hall pass and keeps booting me back here. I don't see anything in here. Look at this poster of you guys. See that? Study or else. Or else what? This guy's gonna shoot you? <laughs> can I go out this door? Maybe I can bust through this door. Oh, nope. Dark links here as well. Awesome. No straight A's anyways. I was already accepted into college. You were over it. Okay. So you were just you had enough of high school at that point. You're like, I don't need this, I'm too good for this. I can say I did I don't think I ever got detention and I also never got straight A's, so there's there's that to be proud of. But I got past high school somehow. If I can do it. We know anyone can do it. Okay, now what do I do? No hall pass. Yeah, no hall pass. I think I need to sneak around this guy, but... Oh, I'm actually using this as a weapon. <laughs> Alright. I can't tell when he's looking, though. No hall pass. That's it. Now you're really in trouble. Detention for all of you. The poster looks like Will Ferrell. Maybe, maybe it is. I guess it kind of does. Also kind of looks like Andy Dick, if anybody knows who that is. <laughs> this, is this is messed up, this part. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. No hall pass. That's it. Okay. I mean, there's nowhere else to go, literally. There's nowhere else to go. Am I supposed to, like... <laughs> what am I doing? Any ideas here? Help paint sets in high school. You skip six period to do it. Wow. You guys skipping skipping detention too for that? Go to the bank and get cap and gown money during my lunch, and I came back. Wow. Wow. You were you were one of the bad kids. We can see. I was so quiet in school, guys, that everyone thought I was smart, so they would ask me questions, They'd be like, you know the answer to this, and I'd be like, no, I really don't. Everybody thought I was super smart, just because I was quiet. Uh, I, 
I really don't know what to do here. Let's see if it tells me what to do. Level info. Get at least. Da, 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 da. Get to the high school rooftops. Sneak past the principal. Yeah, sneak past him and his goons. This is hard because I can't tell where they're looking. I mean, this is as far out as I can get the camera. So if them or the goons see me. Oh my gosh. No hall path. The camera's so bad, I don't know what to do. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is that guy gonna turn too? Okay. Okay. That guy to turn. I need him to walk away. The principal is right up there. Come on. He was facing the other direction. You're a good kid, just chaotic. <laughs> you almost never talked. You would just chill by yourself and relax. That's how I was. A lot of the time, too, Dark Link. I feel that. Um, especially at lunchtime. I was super, super shy. You were late to school, mostly skipped first period of chemistry, so when I showed up, the teacher would stop trying to say, Thank you for joining us today, Miss Tan. Oh, so he called you out, Jesse. This is hard. Uh, maybe I can't go that way. I can't see where the principal is. I mean, this is super hard. Okay, now. No hall pass. What? What the? It keeps resetting me at least. If I get caught, it doesn't actually kill me, it just sets me back. <sighs> the cameras are. I can't control the camera either, so I can't really see what's ahead of me or where they're looking. I think if either of the goons spot me too, I also. Whoa, well that was close. I made it. Holy crap. I just oh, made a run for it. Make your way to the science building. Got my weapon back. What is this picture here? Huh. Huh. You were pretty shy in high school though. School was way too easy and you're always bored. Wish I could say the same thing. <laughs> but hey, it helped you get into college, right? So that's always good. Yeah, I was I was really shy around high school time and beyond. This guy's cool. They just call him ghost though, like there's no freaking uh I mean, the character designs are great in this game, but they just have such generic names. At this point, ghosts don't really scare me much. <laughs> do I have my other weapons? No, I, oh, I do. A rocket launcher. I do need health, though. Shoot. My health's about halfway gone. I'm gonna start using my shotgun. Ghost keeps grabbing me. Alright, let's let's kinda skip ahead. So there's an upgrade place. I wanna go there. I just gotta kill this stupid ghost. What the heck is going on? Why am I like puking all over the place? There. The kabod clay is dead. Uh, a nail gun, level 2. 
We will upgrade that. There we go. In the first grade, my teacher told me to shut up, so I vowed never to speak in class or a school setting again. <laughs> that traumatized you. Oh. I was barely ever even like yelled at by teachers. In high school, I think in one of my yearbooks, my students, my peers voted me as the shyest, but also they said I would be most likely to become like a track star or something because I was so fast. I played soccer, so I was like super, super fast. Certainly not as fast as I used to be now that I'm old. Gosh, I really need health. Our great collection of paperweights. That is to say, grade school literature. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Um, did somebody else follow here? Angelic and Bana both just followed. Thank you so much to both of you for following me here on Twitch. I appreciate that. That means a lot to me. I have no idea. You need to see how far the channel has come on Twitch and YouTube since I started. Um, I am so grateful for every person that comes along and sticks around and just has fun. Because that's what it's all about. Mm. Oh crap, there's ghosts here. Can't die here, otherwise I'm going to get sent back. I owe a big thanks to Koya as well for um, really introducing me to some of his friends. It's been, uh, it's been a pleasure. I think I got it. There we go. Yes, I'm a huge soccer fan. You were playing Just Dance. <laughs> I played a Just Dance game once because my friends made me do it once and it was as disgusting as you might expect to see me dancing Take shelter in the chemistry lab. okay um, I'd like to be able to see what I'm doing though I gotta like zoom through here yes health thank goodness and a checkpoint Just dance. It's a good workout. I have some connect games, but I don't have a dancing one. And there's like a lot of those. 360 connect, a lot of the Wii games. I think Just Dance was biggest on the Wii, right? I don't even know what's going on right now. Actually, I kind of do have a dancing game. I have Connect Star Wars for uh, Xbox 360 and that has Star Wars dancing in it that's just like Just Dance believe it or not where you can like pick characters like Han Solo and dance I know everybody's gonna want to see me stream that oh gosh 42 in here I gotta kill uh, I definitely need Nice shotgun. <laughs> I'm just being attacked left and right here. I have, I have no idea. I can't attack right now. I don't, I don't know. I'm just going to get my sword out and swing around. It won't let me switch weapons when the green is up, so... Oh my lord. I'm 
I'm just constantly getting attacked here. This emote, Dark Link with the emote. Thank you so much, Koya. Appreciate it, and congrats on at least the the first go round you guys had on Smash Brothers tonight. You guys did awesome. So that's some very enjoyable matches there. Take care, my friend. You guys want to see Dark Link play uh, Just Dance? They won both? Oh, that even better. Wow. Oh, I somehow got out of that alive. See, I told you you guys were good. You don't dance, you can't even move your leg. <laughs> I. I dance, just not, not very well. And usually only at weddings or when I'm drunk. Alright, one of y'all better stream Just Dance then. I mean, I'm gonna stream a Hello Kitty game at one point, so... <laughs> I have a Hello Kitty game I'm gonna play. I have no idea how that's going to go, but why not play it? Shoot, I'm going to die, I'm going to die. Oh, put the chair down. It's like two of these guys. Come on, come on. Wow, everything's blowing up and killing me. You have like 10 Hello Kitty plushies. Oh, yes. <laughs> Jesse. Um, hold on. Jesse's going to send me uh, liquor through Postmates so I get drunk to dance. Is that what you're going to do? Which Hello Kitty game? I have Hello Kitty Seasons for the Wii. I found it in a thrift store for a dollar and I bought it. You literally collect Hello Kitties? That's awesome. I don't really know much about Hello Kitty at all, so... Um, yeah, hold on. It's, it's right over here. Let me show you the cover of it. Whoops, my TV just changed uh, inputs. Let me switch that back. You guys can still see the game, though. No, I can't. Because it's my TV just changed, but yeah, we're gonna go to the next the next level. Hold on, Big City Dreams. I've never played Animal Crossing. I've never played. Yeah, I mean, I know about Animal Crossing. So yeah, this is the one I have. This is Hello Kitty Seasons. If you can kind of see that, maybe not. Uh, for the Wii. I saw it in the thrift store for a dollar. Like, uh, I was like, I gotta get this. I will buy the dumbest games if I see them in the wild for cheap. Do you guys know what characters your favorite? I don't know what characters are in this, but it's like you know, it's like a town. It's kind of like I tried it like for like five ten minutes when I bought it just to see if it worked. And it seems like it's kind of like a poor man's hello. I mean, a poor man's Animal Crossing, really. Have you played this game, Angelic? You love Karapi? I don't know if Kar I have no idea who's in this. It says your favorite Sanrio characters will help you on your adventure. Build up your town, customize your avatar, unlock upgrades, and more. Go on exciting missions as the seasons change. In Sanrio Town. You have played that game. I love that we're just this just turned into like a Hello Kitty stream. 
So yeah, this this one's this one's on the list, guys, to, to stream. Everybody's patiently waiting. All right, school's out. It says. I also have a Barbie game. Jesse, you you were there when I bought that one. <laughs> We has the best worst games for sure. Can I upgrade anything? There is nothing that I can Oh I can build new Level what the frick? Defibrillator Flamethrower, oh yeah, we're building that. So you can build new weapons with parts too. So there's all sorts of... So now we have a freaking flamethrower. Tangled. Yes, the Tangled game. You were there too. Barbie Life in the Dream House. Now that sounds like a show I could binge. <laughs> if it's bad, it's even better then. Let's burn them. Okay, the flamethrower is weird. It only works in spurts. I don't know if I like that. I'm gonna... Rocket launcher. I mean, I got a lot of weapons now. Let's zoom in a bit. Here we go. This is a better camera angle. Dang, this game's so much more fun when it's just like, it's more manageable. Bye bye, Dark Link. Thank you again for uh, coming in another stream. I appreciate that. Have a good night, my friend. Honor to have y'all here. Ken calls her Barbara <laughs> when he's upset. Come on, Ken. This thing's freezing. The game can't handle what's going on right now. Probably until I kill this guy. There we go. Jeez, Louise. We got Zeppelins coming in. I would never call Barbary, uh, Bar Barbie Barbara. That just sounds. It just doesn't sound right to me. Oh my gosh, another one? This nail gun's really like the best thing I have going. The game keeps freezing because it can't handle itself. <laughs> Let's get some health here. This game's so chaotic. Oh my gosh. The closet is evil. 1950 doll can't move her, her joints. <laughs> Yeah, what's the freaking, what was the Barbie game I did buy? Like, what is that? It's your guilty pleasure. Oh, come on, doesn't need to be guilty, does it? I have no guilty pleasure. I don't care what people find out that I like. I like what I like. Aliens coming in. It definitely needs to be guilty. <laughs> you forget which one it was, Jesse? Yeah, I think it was some island adventure or something. I can't remember what the heck it was. 
you cared, you would not have a million plushies. Yeah, well, there's nothing wrong with that. I get the appeal of Hello Kitty, let's just say that. Some things I don't understand why they're, like, popular. But with that, I mean, I get the characters and how marketable all that is. Ooh, ha, ha, ha. It's always the principal. Not just Hello Kitty. Look at this. Look at this. Here we go. Should I see if I can get my rocket launcher going against him? I don't think there's any healing things here, so we gotta be careful. Rocket launcher should be enough to kill him. Shoot, oh, he just kicked me. The tension for you. Rocket launcher's ruining him. Hit the barrels. <laughs> you have a realistic size slaw. Jesse, you have your uh your stingray. I used to have um some stuffed animals when I was a kid. I used to sleep with them. I won't I'm not afraid to admit that. I had Michelangelo from the Ninja Turtles. I don't remember what other ones I had. I had like a, I had a few. I think I had, I think I had like a Roger Rabbit one too, I want to say. Yeah, I had a Roger, I definitely had a Roger Rabbit one. I still have my Michelangelo one from when I was a little kid. It's the only stuffed toy I still have from back then. Orca whale. He's still alive? This is gonna be a problem. Alright, these other androids might keep showing up if we don't get rid of him. Flamethrower's not gonna work. Um, Right, let me get back to my rocket launcher. Because they are going to kill me. Those blue rings. Stay away. This is going to be close. You have some of your stuffed animals since you were a kid. Cabbage back kid. Cabbage patch kid. Uh, yeah, I remember cabbage patch kids. I think I probably might have had one of those too. <laughs> I remember garbage pail kids too. Those creepy cards. I, used to collect. Um, I think I had a Care Bear too. I want to say I had a freaking... No, I had a Popple. Does anybody remember what a Popple was? This game's like getting so loud. What do I do here? It's like three forms to this guy. I definitely need the rocket launcher to beat him here. So what I gotta do is probably dodge here. Shoot him, shoot him. 
I'm like mashing the trigger button. I mean, I have 300 freaking missiles to launch, so it's not like I'm wasting ammo. No! He knocked me off the roof. Darn it. Care Bears. Beanie Babies? Yeah, I remember Beanie Babies. You remember Popples? Older than you? I'm probably older than everybody. I mean everybody. People on my, from my from my channel, they all want to know. A lot of people want to know how old I am. <laughs> it's a mystery still. We have to go through his second phase again, and then the third one. This is tough. He's hard to dodge. There's no good way to like dodge his incoming stomp unless I keep moving. Darn it. Surrounded by boomers. <laughs> older than Koya? <laughs> I didn't know people could be older than Koya. <laughs> yeah, I'm 72 years old, so... This part here, this is where we're gonna. These barrels are gonna get me killed. See, I can't dodge those attacks. Keep launching them at him. This gets his health down so much faster. Is there any way to dodge this? See? Whoa! Even the radius of it like, hurts me. I think there I gotta dodge his attacks and wait to get to this to hurt him more. Can't dodge that. Wow. Hundred and eight. They all treat you like you're the youngest. Mm. Isn't it good to, to feel young though? Younger than you might be. I need to preserve more health here at this part if I can. But it's so hard to dodge his attacks. Especially with this thing shooting me too. This is the first part of the night we're really struggling on. See, this on normal would have been impossible to get by. I got these blue rings constantly after me, too. Look at this. There's no way to stop them from coming at you unless you get hit by them. This is way too hard. I've already lost too much health. Look at this. <laughs> what do they expect me to do here? In these parts. I have no health left. I'm just gonna let him kill me. I don't have to do this over. Just kill me. Because you sound and look like you're 12. 
You're a whole adult, though. You pay taxes. Oh. Well, yeah. You gotta be at least 18, right? You look like you're 12. Well, at least, uh, I mean, it's good to look younger, right? <laughs> Jesse, you're, you're young. You're still much young. But he's young compared to me. <sighs> this is gonna... This He, like, lands on me and I can't do it. I'm gonna try a different weapon, too, because... I feel like he's just hitting me. Maybe I can... Easier to dodge with this. I gotta get rid of this thing. There we go. Okay, now. I think she can dodge better with this weapon, too. I think she has a, a longer dodge. It's not as heavy as a, wep of a weapon. Problem is, it takes so much longer to kill him. I guess it's not that much longer because I have upgraded this weapon. I think we're doing better with this. There we go. <laughs> you can legally drink. They don't think you're right. I mean, that's good. They're checking your ID. It's going to be a good thing. You know, I always think, you know, if you're like 40 or something and people are still checking your ID, or even in your 30s and you're checking your ID, I guess that's, you know, good too, right? I bet Jesse you get carded every time. Because you do look younger than you are. And you are young, but you look even younger than you are. with this I, I can kind of hit him when he's in the air still too jump over that don't want to get hit by the electric thing I think that takes away the most health oh yeah dodging way better with this I think we're going to get him this time I should have been using this weapon the whole time yeah look at that I can like pretty much outrun that target now he's going to do that jump over that Gonna do this again, huh? Yeah. What, three? What? How many missiles is that? Remember, he can knock me off the edge and kill me in one hit, which is dangerous. Let's see if I can get through this. Even if your ID scans, they still think it's fake. Like. We almost got him. We almost got him. Die. There we go. The card occasionally you always get mistaken as being younger. Like obviously I can see that. Some fake scan. Oh really, Angelic? And how would you know that? Right? How would you? Know? Hmm. Oh my gosh, we gotta like run here before this whole place comes down. Where am I going? Wow. The roof literally caved in on us. <laughs> Me going to buy alcohol with my grandma so they know you're 21. <laughs> yeah, I get carded at liquor stores. Sometimes. You know, but... Liquor stores... Will know me, so... <laughs> What is happening here? This is absolutely insane. This is a game you probably want to play when you're drunk. Oh 
mean, knowing where to go here is a bit of a problem. Screen shaking all over. <laughs> This is like harder than the boss. Because I can't even, I don't, I can't tell where to stand here without getting broken in. The screen's all over the place. Just getting out of here. Where do I even go? It's pointing me this direction. Let's go over here then. This is. Oh, I'll take a leap of faith. I can't. <laughs> oh my gosh. She goes with a midnight gas station runs and everything. Wow, that sounds like a fun grandma. That's where you get your bubbly personality from. That's good. I want to hang out with your grandma. <laughs> been doing let's go to the next level we have a little Gatorade though this game takes a lot out of you and we continue on all your friends like her more than you <laughs> Oh, Larry. <laughs> she takes your insta pics during quarantine. <laughs> Everybody needs a designated insta pic taker, right? Oh, we can see that. Do you want me to take Insta pics for you, Jesse? I'll take pictures for you. They're not gonna look good because I'm gonna be the one taking them, but. I don't know what to do with cameras half the time. Even though I have like photography videos on my YouTube, I still have no idea what I'm doing. I don't have an Instagram, so I don't gotta worry about that. At least he tries. We're talking about the B movie? You know there's a game for the B movie. It's probably really bad though. Absolutely terrible, don't watch it. You realize that's only gonna make me want to watch it. 
more. Gather the janitor's bones. We're in like a graveyard now. Oh, okay. I remember this level too. I remember playing this one. This is like a maze. Gotta break the graves to get through. Keep going around, keep going around. There's one in here, crap. I don't know how to get inside the main gate here. To like fight your way through all this. Here we go, there's one. The girl falls in love with a bee. Sounds sounds like a wonderful plot. I wonder what the game, how, how bad the game is. You don't want to watch it, Jesse? Oh, we can watch Bee Movie one night if you want. I still think I, we should have our 80s movie night. That sounds more fun than watching Bee Movie, but who knows. Jesse and I are going to have an 80s movie night one of these nights when I'm fully recovered from COVID so we can because so I have a few on DVD and, and we're going to try and watch Back to the Future as well part's going to be a chore, I think. Oh, crap. We should go back to Larry after attaining each key. We have to go all the way back around. Yeah, I've had, I'm just getting over it now. I, it's got me really bad. Um, but yeah, thank you though. I'm I'm doing much better than I was, you know, a week, two weeks ago. So I'm finally back to streaming pretty regularly now. It was awful. But you know, we all, but people have gotten it worse than me. So I'm very grateful in a sense that I didn't get it worse. It was bad, but you know. It could have really done more damage to me. I mean, it tried, it attacked, it was scary because it attacked a lot of different parts of my body. It attacked my throat, my chest. A lot of my muscles were just aching. You know, I had fatigue, horrible fatigue, and fevers, chills, headaches, nausea, a lot of trouble breathing at one point. <laughs> Jesse's been a, a huge, huge help in why I feel better. She's been really helping me a lot by getting me supplies and stuff. So I would not be feeling the way I am now without her, so we can really thank Jesse. Is there another bone in here? Got a bone to pick with this level right now. Did I get it? I don't know where the bone is. This is uh this is kind of weird. Do I have to bring this back to I 
Maybe I have to bring these back to him. Maybe. I have one of the bones, but... Yes, Jesse, um, lucky for me, is my girlfriend, yes. I mean, she, uh, I've never met anybody like her before, and it's, I'm <laughs> so lucky to be with her. We have so much fun when we're together. And thank you. Imagine being able to talk to boys, can't relate. Why not? Why, why can't you talk to boys? I couldn't really talk to girls, I was shy. Like, if I had known Jessie when I was, like, in high school, I would have never been able to really talk to her. I'd have been too shy. Now we're in some gargoyle graveyard. I really don't know what's going on. It wants me to go past some of these. Yeah, Jessie's uh, clearly settled, settled for me. <laughs> she could do better, right? But not, um, I just want you to be happy. That's all. That's all I want. You can make you as happy as possible. Angelic, is there's no I know it's it's hard to go up and talk to people sometimes but you kind of just have to honestly if you just be yourself and just I know it sounds cliche you just have confidence about it the right people will will you know you'll attract the right people just continue to be you and do what you love don't try and be something you're not and then you know the, the right people will be attracted and be there for you you know, it's a great thing about Jessie. She accepts me for who I am, and I accept her for who she is. You know, she doesn't have to change herself to be with me. She just has to keep being her. This is like, I gotta do another kill count thing, so there's like these monster fests with every bone I collect or something. I don't know where they all are. Where are these monsters at? I keep falling in these stupid graves. It's the gargoyles. This level's kind of confusing. There's like 18 different like pointers on the screen, which isn't helping me to know where I'm going. <laughs> Like, do I gotta collect the bones and return them first, or do I can I go collect them all in one go around? Jesse, I'm serious though. Like, we have fun doing anything we do, right? We have a lot in common too, which also helps, and just, you know. I just, I'm more excited about where we can go and what we can do and all the things we're going to do. And making her as big a part of my channel as I can. <laughs> Is that how you flirt, Angelic? It's okay. Big guys. Ooh, these freaking guys. Ah, oh, we got them. We got them. But yeah, it's uh, like I used to be. Like I said, I used to be super shy. I wouldn't talk to you know a lot of people in school, and it's kind of hard for me to, to ever talk to any crushes or anything like that. Um,
As time progressed, I got a little less shy now, and certainly when I first started streaming, I wasn't as open as I am now. Like, I am very comfortable now on camera and talking, and it's like not a problem for me, you know, because when I first started streaming and all that, I had no idea what I was going to be doing. I was like, am I going to be able to do this? But with anything, you just got to keep doing it. I love that Angelic is giving us a little backstory here. <laughs> Sometimes it's tough to know the signs, though. You know, you gotta, you gotta um, be honest about how you feel. There's like so many freaking graves here. How am I supposed to dodge all these? Game is like freaking out right now. Okay. All right, to the next bone, wherever that might be. Over here. So the bones kind of aren't marked. They're just like they they point you in a direction, and then is that one that I just get one? No, it's not one. What's that red thing right there? It's Jolt. Is it pointing me this way? Better use that elevator to avoid falling into that pit of doom. Hit the switch. Pit of doom. Okay. Gosh, what's happening? Is this gonna stop or do I have to? Gosh, this this level is so confusing. We're just gonna go with it now. Is that a UFO? Great. As I jump off the edge and die. Digs your vibe. Hey, what a compliment, right? No one's ever told me they dig my vibe before. There's like two more bones over here, I think. Let's just go this way first. And can we upgrade anything? Oh, we got a chain gun. Look at this. Still gonna use these for now. Like, these markers are like out of control here. Point me in whatever direction. I'll even get in here. And look at this level. It's all over the place. How do I get in here? Pretty sure there's gonna be a bone in here. There we go. See, it's such a maze. You have to like, there's like one way in and out of every little area, and you have to find it. You get so turned around. And look, this is a dead end. We went all the way this direction.
<laughs> what? Is this a dead end? No. See, there's one way right here. It's like, my gosh. This is probably one of the worst levels. Go in here. There's gotta be a bone in there. Some random guy trying to get you in his car. Oh my god. Be careful with that. Now we got witches. This game, I tell you, this game's got everything you need. Maybe I'll fight him from in here. Spiders and witches. Meanwhile, there's like zombies on the outside. Now we got black cats too. Clowns. I mean, there's no shortage of en enemy types in this game, that's for sure. Anything you could possibly put in a horror game is here. <laughs> I got. I just got turned into a frog, by the way. That happened. Got a ghost coming in. This game's having some performance issues here. There we go. Okay. Philly? Are you from Philly, Angelic? Philadelphia, I take it. Without feeling in danger. Yeah, Jesse. You know I got you, though. But I do always expect you to carry um, pepper spray on you no matter what, just to be safe. That make that also makes me feel better knowing that you're carrying that. <laughs> People are crazy. Philadelphia have a pocket knife. Okay, it's good. I love Philadelphia. I'm I was born in Philadelphia. I'm from Pennsylvania, so that is my city. That is my, my state, Pennsylvania. I'm a Philly sports fan through and through. I got a lot of family in Pennsylvania. This is my we just need two more bones. Two more bones. We'll find our way out of here. <laughs> Hoagies. Hoagies are where it's at. Freaking cheesesteaks. I love that we call them hoagies. Soft pretzels, cheesesteaks, hoagies. Boys to Men, Will Smith, Kevin Bacon. Philadelphia. Wawa, oh my gosh, yes I miss Wawa. Man, they're awesome. So much better than 7-Eleven. Philly's best. Yeah, Philly's best is my favorite. Jesse, we gotta go there again. I can't believe that place is over here. Um, so there's one over here. I mean, this level is so hard to navigate. I'm just trusting these arrows get me to where I need to go. Like, they tell me to go this direction and it's a dead end. What? We have three of the five bones, so... It's over here. I guess we should try and find Jolt as well. The 
I actually haven't spent a lot of time in the actual city of Philadelphia, believe it or not, because I never lived there. I've been a few times. Obviously, I was born in the city, in a hospital in Philadelphia, so... Um, these icons are just like... Here's some jolt. Just what we needed. Get some ammo too while we're here. Which part of Philly was I from? Well, I, I lived outside the city, so I'm from I was from Ben Salem, a town called Ben Salem, which is maybe like 40 minutes outside of Philadelphia. I guess suburb outside of there. You go to school there. Okay. Amish. <laughs> Yeah, that's where my, my grandmother lives in a very Amish area. It's great. Ben's not Ben Salem. <laughs> I, I take it you've been there. It's a small town. I, I, I haven't been there since I was like... I moved away when I was like 10 years old, so... So we got another bone. We have one more. I think it's down that elevator. Uh, uh, eh, uh. <laughs> Again, that's a dead end. Want to take a trip to Philly, Jesse? We can. I would like to go there again. Like, really explore the city. That'd be nice. We could probably stay with my, uh, my cousin Chris. I think he lives there. Him and his boyfriend have a, a an apartment there or something. Probably stay with them. Oh my gosh. Imagine if your my grandmother was your neighbor. <laughs> that would be fantastic. Uh Pretty funny. Like, I'm trying to get where this arrow is pointing me, and it's like so hard to find. Here we go. This is where the last one's gonna be. <laughs> I want to stay near where there's guardrails so I don't freaking jump off this thing again. that monster fest is going to start so we can get through this. I swear if one of these bastards knock, knocks me off of here. Okie Dairy? I don't know if I've heard of that before. Oh, she turned me into a freaking frog! I can't even fire right now. I swear, if this guy knocks me off of here... Come on, come on. No, no, I don't want this. I don't want that. What... What's going on? No! Gosh darn it, you knocked me off. That's what I was afraid of. Come 
<laughs> the only diary. At least it started me back here. So I haven't been. Uh, last time I was in Pennsylvania was right before Christmas in 2017. I visited my my grandmother and my my brother. So I haven't been in about. Well, it's been four years now, almost. Three years. You want to set them off to free? Are there buggies? Yeah, there's buggies with horses and everything. The Amish, you'll see them. Uh, with the with the buggies with the horses. It's way different over there. It is here. I mean, Pennsylvania is super different. There's, you know, it's a lot less congested. There's a way more land. You'll see like hills and kind of like small mountains. Lots more country land, and especially outside the city. Like It's difficult because trying to stay on this thing is such a task. They just knock you off. There's not much you can do to stop it either. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. I do this as quick as possible before I get knocked off. No, don't you knock me off. I'm so scared that this thing's going to knock me off. No, 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 no. Oh, we got that. I think we did it. Wow. Okay. Go down. Farmer's markets. Hershey Park, uh, Poconos Mountains, yeah, there's the Poconos Mountains over there. I swear, if one of these things, this thing needs to hurry up and get down there. The longest elevator ride of my life. I just want to get down there. The last bones down here. Like it's so cheap too, because if we jump off of here, we die. Even though the platforms are right there. Best to just stand in a quarter with guardrails. Vampire now? A lot of haunted places in Pennsylvania too. I've never been snowboarding or skiing. So many different controls to learn in this game. I'm just gonna figure it out. So you can double click to fly. Once to jump. Alright, we have that. We can also use B. Oh wow. Okay. So we gotta get over it. I 
not just like fly over there. What just happened? Isn't that the bone we need right there? What happened? Why do we not? We like aren't the vampire anymore. Now we're definitely gonna die. Mm. Get away from me, cat. Look at this. I think there's enough enemies. Witches get stitches. Yeah, Jesse, we do like haunted stuff, don't we? I think it's fun. But you'll never go to uh, Centralia. I want to go to um, so at least some haunted place. It'd be kind of fun to visit for a night. I need like another weapon. Oh my, these stupid cats are gonna be the death of me. This is insane. I got like freaking the witches from Hocus Pocus trying to kill me right now. They're all turning me into frog. Into a frog. Philly, New York. Oh, I love New York. I've been to New York City several times. Not, oh, I shouldn't say several times, a couple times. Um, New York City's great. Jesse's been to New York as well. got the connections for you. Um. Oh, the bone's over there. I see it. I need to go back this way. Now we have all the freaking bones. Let me get out of here. Oh my gosh. Seems like we can almost jump in this muck. From Philly to New York all the time. It's an $8 bus trip. Yeah, Philly and New York aren't that far away from each other. In all seriousness, it's... Like there's probably parts in Pennsylvania where it's like, or towns in Pennsylvania where it's easier to get to New York than Philly. Might be less time. Alright, now that we have all these, where do we gotta go with them? Gathered them bones, we did. I think we gotta take him back to a certain area. I'm gonna ride this freaking elevator back up. Vermont. Vermont's supposed to be beautiful, like all those parts in uh, New England up there. I mean, I used to live in New England for a long time. Um, like Vermont, New Hampshire, and Maine, they're supposed to be like some of the best living in the country up over there. It's very beautiful. My brother has been up to Maine a few times. He loves it up there. It's 
more peaceful up there. I think it's like cheaper too. Some beautiful, beautiful areas. Okay. Return to the ghost. I know how to get over there. Jesse, you should go to New York again, though. We could go, too. If we go down to the East Coast, we can just go to, like, Philly and New York. <laughs> Alright, guys. Now, let's see if we can... I would love to upgrade... There's a lot of weapons in this. If I can upgrade the nail gun again, that would be cool. That's my use, most used weapon here. See, I don't know if I need to go in there or go around this. No idea where I'm going. Following the arrow. In here? Yeah, I do miss. I do miss the east a bit. You know, I mainly just miss my friends and family that are over there. But the barter system is hard at work today. Get to the sewer. Get to the sewer. Oh my gosh. <laughs> More witches. Gargoyles. I'm like, this game impresses me with the amount of different enemies that are in it. It's really great. I'm like, I wonder what else could possibly be in this game now. So we're probably only like halfway through it. It's a pretty long game. So far, I've put about six hours into this game or more. And I play through. Dun. Jesse, are you relaxing now? Or are you still organizing stuff? Hope you're relaxing. I'll stretch out a second here. See, when you get old, you stiffen up. Yeah, yeah. We have the magic gem. Clarice. Jeez. Defeat the ghoul squad. They're just launching dynamite at me. None. Is this ghoul school? Or monster high? Pull it with the grenades. Shoot, she's got me cornered. Ah. Now, now I'm gonna die. <laughs> this 
game's so shaky. Head to the back to the mansion. I'm gonna go get some more stuff first. Jolts. Alright. Grab that. Alright, so. Got more parts, because I do want to try and upgrade this weapon again at some point if I can. Freaking chairs out of the way. Look what's up here. All this stuff. Take all of it. saw more stuff. There we go. Gears. Oh, we only have four of those. Those are probably good to get for upgrade purposes. Before we head into the sewers. Maybe we'll try and knock one more out tonight. I don't know if anybody's still watching. <laughs> it's been a long one. It's late. We should keep on Angelic. You are still here. Thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. Appreciate that. It's been fun talking to everybody here. Jesse's always supporting me in here. Keep doing your organizing, Jesse. Don't even don't even worry about chatting with me right now. If you want to do your organization, go ahead and do it. We're just chilling anyways. If anybody wants to lurk or who is lurking, that's not it's not a problem either. I'm having a lot of fun playing this. This is a uh, this is definitely kind of a nostalgic thing for me to be playing this game a bit. You'll tune in whenever you can. Well, we'll be so happy to have you, Angelic. So we're going to go to the next level here. We're playing all sorts of jank games. I play a lot of Breath of the Wild lately. State of Decay 2. Um, and one day we'll get to this Hello Kitty game. <laughs> Actually, I could start streaming that like pretty soon because... I really don't have a ton of different series going on right now. I kind of just came back to this to see if we can make some good progress, and we have. Get out of the sewers alive. Immediately dies. Professional gaming at its finest. A sewer? I really need to fire my travel agent. I love Carrie. Okay, let's see if we can just hop along, hop along, go in here so I don't fall in. Somebody taking a piss? What's going on in here? Scorpions? Oh, they're huge! Don't knock me in, don't knock me in. Getting away. <laughs> Checkpoint, alright. Um, 
more witches? More parts over there to get. Oh shoot, look at all those guys coming. I wonder how many levels are left. Because we went, we started level 7 tonight. We've done probably at least 4 or 5. This has got to be like level 12, 13, something like that. So there's still a good amount of levels left, I think. Gems, I want all the gems. Alright, bastards, come get me. Oh. Samurai. Robots. Spiders, of course. My worst nightmare. Pumpkins. Oh, I almost jumped off there. And I did. <laughs> All right. We're fine though. There should have been a checkpoint somewhere. If not, it's not that big of a deal. Oh yeah, there was a checkpoint. So we got to go back this way. They weren't set that far back. And the enemies don't respawn either. So you get back there and you just kind of got to catch up to where you were. Collect all this. I like the fact that you can also pretty much pick up anything in the levels and use it as a weapon. There's another checkpoint. Okay, um, so we just jump over this. This looks like a monster fest waiting to happen. Uh, do we have a new enemy type? The vulture or something? What the frig? Harpy. Another enemy type. Is there? there you go. Oh, it did like kill the egg too. It like forms into an egg and then you have to shoot it again. So now we're we going back. Apparently, we're going back the direction we were. Or is this a, maybe this is a new direction? Oh my gosh! Wow. Darn it. No, don't knock me into the water. I'll get in here. Wow, clowns, lots of them. Shoot. I feel like I'm going the wrong direction, though. I don't want to smile for the camera anymore. I don't have an Instagram, so get away, get out of here with that. Somebody. Those guys take a while to kill too. <laughs> I 
Okay, let's get out of here. So... There's no way around over there. Maybe I gotta get up on that bridge or something. That's a dead end. <laughs> I don't want to say cheese. You say cheese. Looks like we're going this way. Great. They're still chasing me, those picture guys. Yes, checkpoint. Look at all the enemies that are on the screen right now. So many gems, it's like so easy to just keep refilling our health, so that's just good. Okay. Okay, we're in another room just like this one. Another monster fest? <laughs> I have another enemy type. Swamp Boy. It's a great name. They really didn't even think about the names for their characters. They just went like the most obvious thing. They created a bunch of characters and they were just like, let's just name it whatever it is. If it's a pumpkin, we'll name it Pumpkin. If it's a bat, we'll just call it Bat. This probably will be the last level I do for the night though. Because it's been a long stream. But oh, I'm going to come back to this. Especially if people are still interested in the, in the playthrough. I'm going to keep eating levels. Try and get through the game. There we go. Da, 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 da. Now we're going back over here. Boat now. Oh, we still need a lot of parts for that. Like rare parts, probably. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. She says. Every vehicle we find come on. Alright. How do I shoot? Like that. Don't let the hovercraft get destroyed. I'll try not to. another weapon besides this missile? Which is again... Oh no no no, get back in. Don't do that again. Is this, is this where I'm going? Time, please. Great, another collectathon here. I can drive this thing on the ground. I'm, I'm digging that.
my gosh. I love that I'm not even in water anymore and I'm just I'm still going. Like this doesn't matter to the game. else am I still fighting? That's oh, one of those dogs, the chihuahuas. Oh my god. Uh, we got the green gem. So now we need uh, four more, just like the bones. Now a monster fest? We're going to have a monster fest after every gem. We got pirates, zeppelins. We're getting surrounded here. Witches. It's hard to hit the witches with this thing. Because it has like a a curve to it. It's like an arch. Can't shoot straight up. Greatest gameplay ever here. If we have to do this after each coin, this is going to take forever. Plus our boat does not regain health. So, what? Leprechaun's back. Fastest racer. Oh no, freaking rings. We have to hit all the checkpoints and beat that Zeppelin to the finish line. Well, this ain't gonna happen. Him with these freaking rings, like really? Darn it, tree. I wish those other coin icons would just go away during this because they're kind of throwing me off. Which direction I gotta go? the gem. I have to get out to get it. Come on. Please don't tell me we have another monster fest either. Let's go for the purple one next, I guess. Just in there. Billy. Billy's back? 
Oh, come on, Billy. Thought we talked about this. See you, Billy. Sorry, I can't stay and talk this time. Alright, guys, now we need. Blue or the red one? The blue one's apparently right over there. I can't skip by these trees though. Blue one's just chilling right here. Okay. No. Wow. <laughs> Gotta be kidding me. Don't tell me we have to get all those coins over again. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. Wow, all because I just fell in the water and made one little mistake. The game punishes me that much, okay. nightmare that was. I can't believe I have to do all this over again just because I accidentally hit the wrong button to jump out of the vehicle. Monster fest. Gotta do this again. So we're gonna be here for a little while longer it looks like. I can't even turn my vehicle around because they are bumping me. Don't hit Y when you're in the vehicle unless you're on land. I tried to get back in and I just died. Go get all these freaking coins again. <laughs> these pirate ships take a while to kill, too. Oh my gosh. No, get in it, please. Don't jump in the water again. Let's go after the green one over here. Like, launches you out of there. grabbing me. We can get in this thing again. It's the hands that are grabbing me. Watch the hands. Chihuahuas. Okay. We got two coins. Let's go after this one now. Crash into everything. Well, it looks like the red one's over this direction, so why don't we go get that one first? There we go. Find our way out of here.
Oh yeah, we gotta do the race again. This was... We have to hit all the checkpoints and beat that Zeppelin to the finish line. This wasn't hard, it was just... Pointless, this part. The squeaking noise that this ship makes is like so annoying. And we left them in the dust. Okay. Grab our coin without falling in the water here. Just sitting over there, that'd be perfect. I hate how it launches me out, I can't control where I land. Billy. Yeah, Billy, see ya. This isn't as bad as the bone part, though. The bone part was like one of the worst parts in the game so far. Shoot, dead end. It's like, it'd be nice to have like a map or something. Do it. Alright, that better be the end of the level. Maybe a boss fight or something before we end it. Yep. We have a Frankie. Oh, he's huge too. It should be easy enough to that on this. Yeah. Right, let's get in here. We've beaten yet another level, okay. On easy. But hey, I'll take it. As long as we keep progressing. Alright, exit. Alright, exit to main menu. I'm gonna do that. That's gonna do it for this one. <laughs> oh my gosh. More monster madness, and it was indeed madness. So when you go to adventure, you can actually select whatever level you want to start with. From what you've played, so we'll have to start with obviously that one going into the, the sewers or whatever, the, the crypt. I am so grateful for everybody that came in tonight and hung out. Um, it's been it's been a lot of fun doing this doing this game again. Everyone that's been watching here on Twitch. Those that watch on YouTube again thanks for the support in part one. And uh, if you're watching part two, thank you so much. Jesse, thank you for coming in and supporting and ha hanging out. Always, always need to have you here. Always good to have you here, Jesse. I miss you. And Angelic, thank you so much for your wonderful presence. Hope to see you again. Nice chatting with you. Nice to uh, kind of meet you, I guess. Um, and everybody that came in from Koya's stream, everybody that's been watching me, you guys know the drill forever grateful i'll see y'all later take care of yourselves stay safe out there until next time zero is the number <laughs>